buddy Don Gabney from Left Coast Classics and I got one for you. What do you do when the greatest wheeler dealer on the planet calls you and says, hey, Don, can you sell my Citron for me? That's right, Mike Brewer called me, wanted me to sell a Citron DS for him. So here we are, I do the best I can. I'm not sure I can do it quite like Mike, but anyway, what a cool car. We've had a few Citrons over the years over here at Left Coast Classics, but I've never had a DS, let alone a DS estate wagon. And uh, this is a really nicely sorted car. Just about everything in it's working. The blinkers, the lights, the wipers, uh, the, what's it, even the clock is ticking away here. The choke, the car starts up and goes. It's a really interesting car. This is a four-speed semi-automatic. So you shift the car, but you have no pedal clutch. And you actually start it using the lever. So that's kind of trick. I'll have to show that to you. And uh, this is just a nicely sorted car. It's uh, kind of a preservation car. Pieces are original. Things that needed to be redone have been redone. But it's kind of uh, just a nice driving car. Uh, it's got the, uh, you know, of course, this was a Flaminio Berlin design. And it was actually placed third in the 1999 uh, Car of the Century. That's what it was called, the Car of the Century in 1999. And uh, Classic Sports Car actually called it the most beautiful car of all time, which I thought was interesting. I never knew. Anyway, this 2175cc i4 hums along. It runs great. The four-speed semi-automatic shifts beautifully. It's just such an interesting car. Let's take a quick little spin and I'll show you what I mean. Well, thanks for heading out with us on a cruise in this cool 1971 DS Safari wagon or estate, excuse me. And uh, if you have any questions, check out the description. My phone number is in there. You can give me a call. Check us out on YouTube. We hit over six and a half million views early this year, so that's pretty cool. We got a great YouTube channel. We're on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, 
my cool website at Left Coast Classics, and uh, of course, check me out on Wheeler Dealers. Two episodes, season eleven, season fifteen, both episode eight. The fifty-seven T Bird is the old one, and the uh, Lancia Fovia is the latest. And God, I hope there's another one coming besides this Citron DS. All right, thanks for checking us out. Okay, I wanted to head back under because uh, the undercarriage is just so nice on this car. Look at that. It's very solid. It's not rotted. It's in good shape all around. And we've noticed over the weeks that we've had the car, it's just taking a while to kind of get uh, to where we could get to this one. But we got to it. And uh, what I have noticed is when we shut the car off and... Uh, you know, when, it, when it's off, it, it goes down, and when we start the car up and it gets going, it warms up. We have noticed uh, that we do have a little leak coming off this one back here. You can see that see, right there. And over here, this one needs to be replaced. But that doesn't keep the car from going up and down, and uh, we'll make sure we get you a video showing that as well. Now, let's do the magnet. You can just kind of see, I like to do this. You can see, check the filler factor. There you go, so not bad, huh? Magnet sticks well around the car.